A warm welcome to all our Tibet lecturers. I'm Gan Krishna from Macmillan, and I'm going to tell you about the updates to the Mechanical Drafting N4 curriculum. This subject has been revised and is scheduled for implementation in the second trimester of 2024. Lecturers and students will need updated textbooks that include all the new content and changes. We recommend TVET First Mechanical Drafting N4 Students Book and the accompanying Lecturer's Guide. The logo, Revised Curriculum 2024, tells you that the book covers the 2024 curriculum in full. I'll come back to how these books will help you to implement the revised curriculum with ease. But first, let us focus on the curriculum changes. What is the aim of the revised curriculum? Students need to be equipped with problem-solving techniques and processes which they can apply to fail products on a machine or system. The purpose of the course is therefore to develop students' drawing skills and ability to solve mechanical problems. They will learn to draw low-key, displacement diagrams, and CAM profiles. In addition, they will gain skills in drawing primary views of machine components, dismantling them into the component parts, and assembling components from detailed drawings. How does the new curriculum differ from the previous one? In all the modules, the learning outcomes have been reworded to make the requirements clearer. Some outcomes have been trimmed down. The main change relates to Module 1, which used to be called Conventional Representation of a Single Spur Gear. Spur gears in mesh, square threads and helical springs. This content has been completely removed from the 2024 curriculum. What has it been replaced with? The new Module 1 now deals with Loki. Students must be able to draw the locus of a point on a mechanism with up to four arms. Are there any other changes that I need to know about? There are. In Module 2 on CAM profiles, dwell motion is included among the list of displacement diagrams that need to be drawn. In addition to knife edge and roller followers, students must now also draw the CAM profile of flat end followers. What about modules 3 and 4? Module 3 on sectional drawings spells out the outside views as outside front view, left view and top view. The surface texture process for turning has been left out of the new curriculum, along with the outcome called Hidden detail may be asked. Module 4, called Detailed Drawing, spells out in detail what is required under dimensioning. Conventional representations now also include studs. Has Module 5 remained the same? No. Module 5 on Assembly Drawing contains more detail on what is required regarding item numbers and parts lists. An important note states that nuts will not necessarily be shown on the diagram sheet but will be referred to in the parts list. How do the weightings compare? The module weightings in the revised curriculum are the same, even though module 1 is new. Have a look at the table on your screen to see the 1993 module weightings as compared to the 2024 weightings. What can I expect in the exams? The examination for Mechanical Drafting N4 will be a four-hour paper for 100 marks. It is a closed book exam. Scientific calculators are allowed, but no cell phones, programmable calculators, reference works, or any previous exam papers or the memoranda will be allowed in the exam venue. How does the TVET First Students Book help students to succeed. The TVET First Students Book is the ideal textbook to guide students towards success in their studies. It is written by experienced lecturers who understand the needs of students and lecturers. There are many features that support students. These include 
clear explanations that help students understand the content and correct misconceptions. Fully worked examples help students to master the problem-solving process step by step. Many labeled diagrams make it easy to identify and draw different mechanisms and parts. There are also detailed tables with drawings and photos for comparing different elements such as cams, cam followers, displacement diagrams, sectioning, and machining processes. Language support and definitions throughout the book will help students to grasp new concepts and terminology. How does the TVET First book steer my students towards exam success? There are plenty of varied activities that encourage lots of practice with exam type questions, thus preparing students for tests, assignments, and internal and final examinations. Students will find summaries at the end of every module that make revision easier. The book also features summative assessments that test exam readiness. What does the lecturer's guide offer? The lecturer's guide includes the answers to all activities and assessments in the student's book. It also provides an overview of the learning outcomes per module, which you can use to create a 10-week teaching plan for the subject. There is also a two-page lesson plan template, which you can photocopy. We wish you a successful teaching year. Trust TVET first to achieve the best results.